Ladies and gentlemen, these are the minutes for Jovic Sands Happy Clubs, 2nd of August minutes. And today is the 6th of September, and I am now reading the minutes from last month. Here we go. There is about 23 questions, everybody. So this may take some time. Number one, Circus Funfair. We are closer to bringing to Jaywick. We've got this far, we just need Lance. Can Tendering District Council find us land for a funfair or circus in Jaywick? That is what we ask Tendering Council. This is what they said. They answer in red. They said, we'll need to speak to our assistance team to see where this might be feasible. So Tendering Council are gonna let us know where we can do a circus or a funfair. This is great news for the community. Number two, Colchester to Jaywick buses and prams and bus drivers have to help us make the journey longer. Is there anything that can be done about people carrying things on buses? There is great concern in this, in this meeting because it is delaying the buses and holding up the bus journey. This is what the council said. Speak to Dave. <laughs> Only joking. Um, this is what the council said. You need to raise this with the bus company. This is an issue that there are more prams than there is spaces for. So this is something, we, yep, so that's, right, number three, go-karts for Jaywick. Who owns the land where the go-kart go go track once was? We would like to redo it for the community. The council said, again, need to check with assist. If you have some ideas, please put them forward as part of the consultation happening now on www. Can you go on that blue bit there? There is a consultation that everyone needs to get involved in. That's where you need to go. Okay, number four, Glebe Way. There is always smash glass everywhere. Can we please put bins up to stop this happening? The residents are not happy about Glebe Way. The council have said, we we'll suggest some community signs might have to more impact than anything from the council. There are glass recycling points at Golf Green Hall and the Community Resource Centre. There may be more options in the next few months about action of this type. So thank you, that's a great answer. Number five, the kids play area in Jaywick, they don't have a skate park in a bike park track, would be very good for Jaywick and the kids. And the council will reply back. The community workspace project would include public toilets. Shine on. So there you go, we're getting everything done. Right, here's the... Here we go, where was we? That's better, that's better. Here we go. So, this is about the kids' play area in Jaywick. Any ideas for where this could go, please? If there is a suitable location, there are some possible funding options. There may be more options in the next few months about action of this type of issue. Number six, leave... Wayne, he's been to stop... Let's... Thank you. So yes, um, right. Free gym in Jaywick Park would help people keep fit and keep strong. So is there any chance Jaywick can get a gym? And we all said, speak to our open spaces team to see if there is any potential about using 106 money. There may be some options in the next few months about action on this type of issue. Thank you, Tendering Council. Number eight, we need more shops in Jaywick. A lot of them are shut and run down. Is there any way we can get more shops in Jaywick? And this is their answer. We can't directly influence where shops go. We can encourage it, such as potentially setting up in the new commercial workspace we are building. Essex Community Council also has plans for a social supermarket in Jaywick. And look, if we go to that blue link, you can have your opinion in the consultation. Number nine, can we do more to clean Jaywick? The residents, can we have more power to clean Jaywick? And this is their reply. Residents and businesses are always encouraged to clean around their own homes and businesses. Are there any particular hotspots we might be able to help with? There may be more options in the next few months about action of this type of issue. 
Number 10. The seawall is very grey and miserable. Is there any way we can let the kids paint the seawall? The seawall is owned by the environmental agency. So you would need to ask them, I think provided the painting don't affect signs or was not controversial, or we wouldn't have any objections. Might be good to have it organised in some way, perhaps inclusive ventures, for example. So that's great news. We've just got to work out how we're going to paint the seawall, but it's positive. Number 11, Boxall Avenue. We need steps to stop old people falling over. And also when it's wet, become a skate park. Not the sort of skate park we want. They said, where do, we, where do you need steps? As a private road, that might be something we can help with. We need steps at Vauxhall Avenue. Number 12. So that would be all. I will do the rest of the questions in a minute. I've got lots going on. So I will do questions 12 to... 12 to 24, I will do in a minute. But I've just done questions zero to 12. Shine on everybody. These are the minutes from last month's meeting.